they were shooting 60% from the three-point line, um, and we had to get out and defend. And so we changed our defense up a little bit at halftime. We challenged our players to come out second half, and we came out and played uh, very soft defense. I don't think we got the things done that we wanted to get done on the perimeter. Uh, they were able to get the ball in the paint and they scored on the perimeter so they hurt us both places in the third quarter. Made some adjustments in the fourth quarter uh, but it was a little bit too late at that point because we couldn't score in the third quarter. We didn't uh, we didn't knock down any shots and we didn't get any second chances and that's what we have to make a living off of. Yeah, uh, you guys, uh, second time in a row, you guys have won the turnover down. And one in twice off turnover. How is that not translated into uh, one of Well, you know, the, we're winning a lot of battles, in, but w one of the things, they're shooting so well from the floor against us. You know, when people shoot 50%, just not a lot of offensive rebound opportunities for them, not a lot of defensive rebound opportunities for you. Um, and we're shooting in the 20s. So, you know, we're getting more offensive rebound opportunities, but we're not taking advantage of, of what we have. We didn't, we didn't execute very well on offense in the second half. We didn't uh, play the type of defense that we're capable of playing. Um, we got a lot of young kids that played a lot of minutes tonight. I thought Mickey Flores played very well, uh, really responded when the going got tough, and that's something we can build on. Well, I thought, you know, she was trying to lead by example, and that's what you, you hope for when you have players out there on the court. Uh, don't don't uh, listen to what I say, watch what I do. And I thought that's what she did. It's what you're looking for in a point guard, a girl that wants to be the quarterback, wants to do things the way the coaches want it done, and she did that for us tonight. Just didn't have much help, you know, and hopefully we'll get some more people indoctrinated and get them ready for Saturday. Uh, and then Saturday, homecoming. Uh, you guys before the game have uh, the 0405 team having breakfast with you guys. What's the, the message to the team Thursday and Friday going into Saturday? Well, I just told them you're going to be playing in front of some uh, young ladies who are record setters. Uh, they're going to come here and they're going to watch us play. And at the end of the game on Saturday, we're, we'll invite them into the locker room to give us a critique because we're trying to carry on the tradition that they started. And I want to know from these champions from 2005, um, who on our team you feel like is playing championship caliber basketball. Let's, let's be ready to call them out and talk to them after the game. So we'll have them in the locker room before the game and after. So it should be a good event.